Hey everyone, welcome to Austin Canadian Homes. I'm your host, James. And today, yes, we're at a virtual tour of the Princess Margaret Cottage Lottery. And this one is the cheapest prize of the three. But it's not cheap, guys. $2.4 million. Cottage. And it's in White Lake, Corthus. So the second Kawartha Cottage of the three prize that they have for the summer 2023. Princess Margaret. So you come down, see way over there at the far end, that's you're coming down to this driveway where that porta potty is. You keep coming, keep coming, keep coming down that drive, and then boom, your cottage. Look how much room you have here for your friends and family or your new friends that will want to be your friends have to park their cars. I mean, hell, some of them might park their RVs here because they want to live right beside you. But don't let that happen. Just uh, tell them, no, you're here to visit, and that's it. Anyway, it looks pretty nice from the outside. Look, you can see the lake already. This is going to be nice. Let's go in. Boom, $2.4 million once again. And, yeah, look at that view. First of all, I'd like to start over with the front door see what we're getting at so here's the front door there's where we were got your coat rack on that side and on this side walk a little further you got the double door closet I'm assuming and then down here looks like a way to get downstairs so be careful don't fall down on your way in and and uh, let's take a look Oh, a little seat there to take off your shoes. That's kind of nice to have when you're 50 plus, definitely. Okay, let's go in here. Powder room, very neutral, I like it. It's a shiplap, it's nice. Got your, it's just your basics, right? That's all you need. Nice and clean, you know, no ants yet. So that's nice, no ants crawling up the pipes or anything. All right, let's get into it. Over 2,068 square feet in this whole little cottage. You're looking at three bedrooms, 2.5 bathrooms. All right, well, let's go keep to the right. Looks like there's a bedroom here. One of the three bedrooms right here on the main floor. Beautiful lake views, that's for sure. I like the chair there, it's very hotel. Feels like a hotel vibe or a resort. Beautiful views again. Looks like you got a little private uh, deck out there for this bedroom. Don't think I can get too too close, but yeah, you're very close to the water and the views are amazing. That's all I know. That's all I know. Oh okay. wait, looks like a walk-in closet. Not a walk-in closet. Sorry. So this looks like your bathroom over here. So let's take a look. That's a closet. You got lots of room in the dresser. And your bathroom is right here. Your standard bathroom and a shower. I'm curious to see the shower head. I'm hoping for rainfall, but what do we got? Uh, oh, yeah, sort of. Yeah. I'd say that's like a rainfall right there. Usually they're straight up over on the ceiling, but. I think that'll do because you got the wand as well. Yeah, very luxurious. I like this. I like that you have a little place to put all your stuff right there instead of going uh, squatting down on your hands and knees to pick up a bar of soap or something that you dropped. So that's nice. All right, so bedroom number one that we saw is pretty nice. What do you guys think? This cottage also comes with $100,000 in cash, so you can use it on maybe some water toys, something like that. This looks pretty roomy. I like the uh, main room here, the family room. Got lots of glass, ceiling, Let's bring in the natural light, tall ceiling, fireplace, TV above it. That looks like picture frame TV. Very nice area to relax and chill all season. I like this a lot. And then you got a staircase to go upstairs. And we saw a staircase go downstairs when we first came in. You got your uh, kitchen table there and uh, your cottage kitchen, which looks um, 
you know, like a cottage kitchen. It's pretty, it's got your modern, um, modern appliances, dishwasher, fridge freezer, stainless steel, double sink, beautiful uh, windows. So you, if you are just rinsing a glass or something, you got a beautiful views right from that sink, which is pretty cool. And your stove, you got everything to kind of cook up, cook up a good stuff, a good meal, even though you're probably going to barbecue for the most part. Again, beautiful, beautiful views. Let's take a look at this 360. Where does this take us? Oh, yeah. This is nicer than I thought. Um, I don't know what this is. A driveway you share with your neighbor, I guess. I guess to dock your boat or something. I wish it was more private, but you know, if your neighbor's nice, I guess that's okay. They got a couple of flags over there. Um, nice pit, uh, fire pit. That's nice. Again, I just wish there was a little more privacy if this is your neighbor here. Uh, but again, very beautiful. You got a nice long dock. You got a, like a little trampoline for the water. I believe it comes with a couple of bicycles, like water bikes. And so this is the outside view, guys, from the top of your cottage. A little spot here as well, and your neighbor is also over on the other side. They're kind of close, but maybe they're previous Princess Margaret winners, so that'd be kind of nice to <laughs> talk about. Hey, isn't life beautiful? And then up here you have a little loft area, so why don't we go up there? That looks kind of neat. All right, so let's continue up. Yep, it's definitely a loft area. So this is kind of nice though to have. You know, if you have grandkids or kids or something like that, this would be a good place to chill out. Ooh, I could definitely work at home here. Look at that. Oh yeah, this is a, never mind the kids. Never mind the grandkids. This is a nice office area. Oh, it's got a pull out. So that's extra additional uh, people can sleep up here if you need to. And a little lookout point to the front. See who's coming up your, your driveway. Very cool. And that's the uh, loft area. We already saw it out here. Again, pretty nice. Did a good job in decorating. You know, it's small, but it's got everything you need. Let's go downstairs if we can. I'm assuming this is two more bedrooms down here, so let's go. Let's get going. All right, looks like there might be a TV here, a sitting area, beautiful views of the water, L-shaped couch is kind of cool. Nice, again, a nice cozy spot to relax. Let's go down this hall and see what we got. Bunk beds. Okay, so this is where your uh, kids or preteens can hang out and have some fun. Your guests will love it. And uh, 360, let's go. Why not? Okay, so they're showing us the, the lake, White Lake. That's what this is called. And there's your uh, trampoline. Be careful here though, it's pretty shallow. So you might want to go further out before using that. Oh wow. Yeah, okay, so I guess it's a shared driveway with your with your neighbor here, like I thought, to dock your boats or so, something like that. Okay, this looks like they, they look like they have a, it's like a rental or something, so many boats. Hmm. I don't know if I love that idea of being a neighbor with so many uh, might be too busy, you know. I'd rather uh, a little more privacy, like I said, and a little, little less noise. I don't know. I just have a feeling this is a rental with all the canoes and all these chairs lined up. and the Yeah, might be kind of nuts, but hopefully not. But this beautiful lake, definitely a beautiful spot. And it's pretty amazing. 
What's this 360? Did we do this one? Let's take a look. Okay, so this shows more of the of your back of your cottage. Some doors to get out. Nicely done in the landscaping at the front there. This is your fire pit. So this is the fire pit view. Again, I like it. Really nice. Man, those views, right? Uh, what a dream. Should we take a look up? Way up. Look at the rainbow even. All right, let's go back in. Let's see what we're dealing with. So we saw that um, one bedroom. That's where we went out. So let's go down the other hall. And we got a washer dryer, so a laundry room on the very modern. Definitely lots of room. I'm surprised the cottage has such a nice laundry room, you know. But it's good to have, especially if you're gonna go spend all your time here, full time living, cottage life, pretty sweet. We got a nice shower with a tub. Very spacious by the looks of it here. All right, so that's a good little spot as well. Let's keep going, guys, on the other side. Third bedroom, right here. Third bedroom with a window that looks into a, another room. That's funny, a screen porch or something. That's funny, right? You open this up and then, hey, friends are over, your family's over, and they're like, oh, so make sure you're dressed before you open that door. Or sorry, the, open those drapes. Yeah, you don't want to be streaking your your uh, family. Looks like sliding doors, that closet there. And this door it looks like it's glass. For some reason I can't get in there, guys. But I'm sure it's a washroom, right? Or, oh. oh, sorry, it's a mirror. I can't get in there, though. So it's a mystery, it's a mystery mirror space. So we'll have to leave that alone, but I'm sure it's a washroom for that room. All right, go around to this porch or screened room, I should say. And you, that's like I said, the bedroom's there, so I'll leave the curtains closed. This is a nice spot to watch a thunderstorm, hang out without getting mosquitoes. Yeah, it's nice. It's beautiful, in fact. Very nice, guys. Very simple. Very down-to-earth kind of place. You can definitely chill here with all your friends. Again, $2.4 million, Kawartha. White Lake is outside, and it's three bedrooms, 2.5 bathrooms, and over 2,068 square feet for your enjoyment. Guys, get your tickets. In it, be in it to win it, and uh, I'll talk to you soon.